it's Sina, Warthog Princess, and welcome to another Vera Bradley haul. This one is just a small one, only two items, but before we get to the first one, um, let me tell you about something kind of new and different you may or may not be aware of. Um, Vera has been doing a lot of collaborations this year, and one of them included a collaboration with the military. So they did release an army pattern earlier this year that's black with yellow in the mini concerto pattern just like the collegiate fan line, except it's army colors. And on the front, they had an army insignia embroidered on them. They released the blanket, duffel, triples of hipster, and tote, I think it was, the Vera tote. So just a limited release items, and they're only available through the military exchange stores. So pretty much at an army base, you get the army stuff, and I guess the idea is later to add the other services. Um, you can also find them at AFES online. Um, I think it says shopmyexchange.com. So if you're a military veteran of any service and you're honorably discharged, you do have access to those things online. If you're interested, just look it up. And you can also get access to the physical stores if you're a disabled veteran. It didn't stipulate a percentage. I'm retired, so I have access, but that's two tidbits that if you're interested, you can find them. But here's what I got. So not only did they release Army, but just recently, I don't know exactly when, but very recently, they released the Air Force One. And in our local base exchange here in Tucson, we had the blanket, it's an extra large throw, the Vera tote, and the duffel. That was all they had. Um, but here it is. <laughs> all right, so uh, it is an extra large throw. Like I said, it is that nice, super soft, everything that we're accustomed to. This is the mini concerto pattern that I was talking about. And since it's Air Force, of course, it's Air Force colors. It's a royal blue with the white. And then they have the Air Force insignia, or one of them anyways. It is embroidered. It's not a patch. I actually thought it was a patch, but it's way better that it's embroidered right in there. So that's kind of cool. And it is retail price $90, but at the exchange, they had them for $56. Um, it wasn't on sale or anything. It's a new release. That was just the price at the exchange. So that was kind of cool. Um, there's the tag. So they do have a special collaboration with, <clears throat> excuse me, the special laser etched thing. And that is Air Force. So, yep, 94 by 66 inches. And there's the MSRP. And then AFI sticker right on top for, I don't know if you can see that. There you go. 56. Anyway, so that is the extra large throw from the Air Force. I also uh, had already bought a triple zip hipster in that pattern that had note insignia on it, and I put my own AF letters on it. I did not pull it out. But so that's enough about the military stuff. The other thing I picked up, um, if y'all been watching my videos, you know I'm a big fan of the sling backpacks, and purple is my favorite color. I do not have anything in the Foxwood Meadow. So when I saw this today, I, of course, I just had to get it. Um, I really like this pattern, to be honest, but I find that it's very pattern placements specific for me. Now that may not be the case for everybody, but like on the smaller pieces, it's just too cut up. I don't like it. And it doesn't come out in a lot of lighten up stuff anyway. Um, so anyhow, I thought this pattern placement was acceptable to me and my OCD and whatnot. Um, because this bottom piece, even though it's not perfect, is almost a complete middle shot. And the other pieces kind of fit enough that it looks like it's mostly intact. And then this middle Y here was sort of centered as well. So it's not perfect, but as far as this pattern goes, this was definitely the best of options available there. So for me, it was an easy pick for, for that. On the back, actually, is what I really liked about it. And there you have uh, almost perfectly centered the piece right in the middle and then the other pieces surrounding it. So I really kind of like that. Not that anybody's going to see the back, but I know it's there, so it made me happy. Now, here's the other question I have about this pattern. Look at the... It's a, ge it's a geometric pattern, so it just repeats this same piece over and over. But look at the piece. This is Foxwood Meadow. And is there a fox? No, it's a woodpecker. Okay. I mean... Woodpeckers are fine, but why is that not a fox? Like, hmm, I was really kind of sad to see that in person. I didn't realize, uh, whatever, it's a woodpecker. So, no other critters. 
uh, at least not that my mind has found. Just the woodpecker, over and over, lots of woodpeckers. So there you go. Okay, but the purple is a true purple, and the inside, if you're not familiar with the sling, wow, that's a scent strip, <laughs> but it's a deep purple as well with the Vera Bradley diamonds on it. And it has this pocket, which has a slip and a couple of pin slots, and plenty of room for a wallet, a phone, whatever else. And then a nice pocket here, and one other pocket on the back. So, doo -doo -doo. this strap is very adjustable. It fits even big girl like me, super easy. And you slide it around and get your stuff. I usually put my phone in this back pocket, which I have the 6S Plus. It's a pretty big phone, but fits very easily and completely in there, and it's easy to get out. So, that is the sling in Foxwood Meadow. And that's the end of my massive two-item haul. Take care. Bye for now.